another fantastic morning. And where are we off to this morning for breakfast? Uh, we're going to try the Golden Corral. Golden Corral, We've yeah. Never We've never done breakfast there before. And they do it on a, what is it, Friday and Saturday? Think, yes. Yeah, Friday and Saturdays That's only. Weekend, it's weekends, yeah, we're we ain't letting sure letting when it is. So we're going to drive down now, see what it's like. And then see where we end up after that. So we made it here, didn't we, Carol? We did. We're so sorry. It's a bit exactly busy. Yeah, okay then. Carol's got an, um, a bit of talking very, very low. Remember, we've got the fluff on here, so we've got to talk loud. So this is where we are, Golden Corral. Oh, you've got a nice car there, making a load and load of noise. Front life out of me, did you? <laughs> Made us jump. So, shall we go in? Shall we? Yeah. Is it going that way, yeah? Yeah? Yeah. So, let's have a little look in here. Off you go, Carol. Please keep going. Right. So that's welcome. I think we get a dis senior discount in here, don't we? Yeah? Go on, keep going, Carol. Keep going, keep going. Yeah. Carol's obviously going to take the queue. I'll wait here for her. Come on, Carol. Come on, Carol. Oh, yeah. She does like walking away. I'm even filming you now, walking along here. So here's your early birds, some of your discounts. Early birds, senior special. Look at that, Monday to Friday, only 10, 10.49. Really, really good value. It was established in 1973. And I have a quick little look at the prices as of today. June today. So I'll just zoom in there. Hopefully you can see all the prices there. Adults, senior, 60 plus, children, lunch, dinner and early bird. So we've never done the breakfast there, so it'd be fun to see. Okay then, so how much did it come to first of all? It came to... Have a little look there. Upside down. 29. 29.80. Well, that's for both of us, yeah? And you got coffee with that? You get coffee and juice. If you want a soda, you've got to pay extra. Okay, right. Oh, all right. So it's extra for soda. And where do you pay extra? You're probably up there. Oh, right. Because I would want a soda. I just want coffee. But anyway, we're waiting to be served. And then we have a quick look, look at the food they're doing at the breakfast. I sit down this table here. We're with family. <laughs> but they don't really want to be on the blogs that much, so we'll be sitting right at the end, won't we? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to have a quick little look around the food while you get seated and get your coffee. I'm just going to show you what they do on this breakfast menu at the Golden Corral. Well, I'll start here. This is fried chicken. Inside that chicken there. We've got cheese sauce. Onions. You've got scrambled egg. Hash browns, you've got corned beef hash. You've got these little scone things, sausage gravy, onions, more chicken, more chips, more Texas toast, some margarine, you've got pancakes, apple toppings, maple syrup, cakes, apple cakes, blueberry, this is where they actually sort of do the grill. I think they do the, the meats here in the um, night time, but as this is a breakfast, you've got ash brands, tomatoes, tacos, mac and cheese, beans. This is a big, big breakfast menu. You're going to find something you want on here. Um, more biscuits. There, hamburgers, rolls, grits, got more tomatoes, cheese, salt, beans, sausages. There is quite a lot here, isn't there? And that's only the first station. I'm going to the next station right now. This is like the fruit sort of sections. I'm going as slow as I can, but people are getting their food and I'm being pushed along. Not being pushed along in the Sally section as people don't really want the salad. So we just carry on here. 
Looks like you can get an omelette over there, cooked to your choice. So that's what the woman's doing there, like cooking the actual omelettes. You ask for what ingredients you want. And of course, when you finish your meal, you've got to have a little bit of jelly, chocolate sauce. Might some creams there. Maybe a cake. Some marshmallows, some biscuits. Remember, this is how much this meal cost us. Now, you know, and we can have as much as we want for as long as we want until our bellies can take it. But yeah, everything here. We've also got dessert there. Product not ready yet. Ice creams. And even more to toppings and everything. So that's a quick, well, quick. That's a look at what they do here. Yeah? I'm now going to go back, put the camera down, and go and get my first meal. Carol's over there in the corner, all by herself. And because we're a big group, they put us in the. Sorry, and that's hello. Nice. And that's the server. It's helping us out really well. They put us in the actual family group here, which is a room all by herself. And there we are on the big table. I went up there, Cal. Have a look in the far corner. They got chicken. All right. Massive big pieces of chicken. I'm going to try them. What for breakfast? For breakfast, it's it's like KFC on steroids. <laughs> it really is. It's like they also got um, nachos up there. You can do your own nachos. They've got everything up there. I've just showed everybody. But this is my first plate, which I won't come from. Which is just, I just went for sausages, some onions, barbecue beans, a bit of meat. I don't know what. I think that was pork. And um, that's corned beef ash. That's corned beef ash, and that's um, scrambled egg. Scrambled the egg, yeah. And also our coffees have come up. I didn't get a juice, so I Did might you get that up there. Yeah, I know. I didn't get one. That's what I said. Did that, didn't I not say I didn't get a juice? I thought you meant, I didn't I get a juice. I'm going to go back and get a juice. I'm going to go up there. I'm going to go up there. Yeah, I'm going to go and get my juice, and then I'm going to tuck in and see what we think of this food. But so far, just looking at the selection. It sounds like a lot of Unbelievably big selection out there, yeah. And they only do this, I think, weekends, isn't it? I think so. I think so. Really you have to look, yeah. Anyway, we'll carry on. And we're all by ourselves in this little corner over here. We Brilliant. Are. So we can talk loud. Yes. So it looks like you actually mirrored what I got, but a little bit of bacon and maybe some... Oh, they look lovely, don't they? I bet they really okay. taste nice. Oh, they're not... Yeah, they are nice. Okay. I wish I got some now. Mm. Oh, they are nice. I'm actually, them yet. I want to know. tin tomatoes, but yeah, it's very, very nice. So, you mirrored what I got. We always have a little competition, don't we? We do, and I've got the better plate. And I think you've got the better plate this time, I must admit. Mainly because of them tomatoes. Okay, but there's always round two coming up soon. <laughs> so, I went up for my second plate, and I couldn't resist it because we are a channel that tries food. And we travel. So oh, this is the. Well, I don't think I've ever had this for breakfast before. Do you think I've ever had this for breakfast before? It's certainly not a breakfast dish. No, I don't know what it's going to taste like. The first one was pretty nice. Yeah, it was standard food, all warm, just what you want really with a breakfast. Nothing really outstanding, but it was just standard sausages and whatever. But this is my second breakfast. I had to do it. I had to go for the nachos. Or my own little sort of nachos and my fried chicken and this was the smallest bit of fried chicken I could actually see <laughs> amongst all that I thought you might have got some country gravy to go with it I had country gravy last time oh, okay. this time it's just this so I'm going to tuck into this now and I'll tell you what I think of it well that was surprisingly good when you mix it with the cheese sauce and the um, what them chips called? nachos, nachos. yeah and the actual chicken as well it was having like, like having nachos like chicken and with the actual um, crispiness of the outside of the chicken gorgeous really good you even had a little taste I didn't you nacho and they're very fresh and you also had a little bit of chicken yeah um, I, yeah it was nice but, but I, me I'd, I'd have nachos and okay. any day well you can go up there and get them you know yeah, but it is this breakfast. is this is an all-you-can-eat buffet I know but I don't want it for breakfast you don't want for breakfast no. I'm going to get something, but not, I'm not going to get that for breakfast. You sure? I'm positive. Enjoying this though, isn't it? Cheap meal. Yeah, it's very nice. It does everything you want. Variety, if you yeah, want to and you could really fill something. yourself up. You're going to the parks, you could come here, really fill yourself up, not eat at the parks, save a little bit of money. 
Which is what our channel is about really, saving money. Well, yeah. I'll try to save money, how would just like spending. If you save it, then it means I can spend it. Those are the rules. It's a no-win situation for me, isn't it? No-win situation. Anyway, I'm going to carry on now. I'm going to go for my third plate. Carol's going to go for a second plate. And then a verdict on what we think of it. And then off we go. I think we're going shopping next. I believe we're going to do some shopping. I definitely think we're going shopping. That's what you said anyway. Right. So let's carry on with the meal. Off you go. You're going to get your second plate. Yeah, I'm going. But I will let this go down and get my third plate. But I do want the desserts up there. The desserts look nice. So we've both decided that we can't have no more, haven't we? We're going, we've, we've gone straight onto the dessert. We've been tempted by the dessert, yeah? Sorry? I don't want that. I'm gonna have a little piece of that when I get back, yeah? Yeah, my one is literally that, but I'm gonna, just a little piece of that. If it's nice, I'll come back for another piece. I'm not happy. I'm not happy at all. While I'm getting me dessert, I turn around and my wife is chatting up to me. <laughs> and I'm thinking, what's going on here? So, who were the two men that you were chatting to? I don't know who they were. I didn't get their names. They just said that they reckon they know me from YouTube. They know you from YouTube, yeah? yeah? And I'm sorry I didn't get your names. Oh, right. Very convenient, because when I actually walked up to them, they just looked at me. They didn't say, I know you from YouTube. <laughs> and they just wandered away. Do I believe her or not? No, we've been recognised so many times out here and it is fantastic when people do come up and say hello to us. And they normally recognise Carol because of her size and the fact that she's always running, well, a long way in front of me. A long, long way in front of me, as you was then. I'm surprised they, they recognised me when I was coming out along on my own because you weren't with me. Normally we always get recognised when we're together. Yeah, as I said, I think they always recognise you because literally they see this little thing just whizzing past them and they think, who's that? Who's that? But it's lovely, isn't it? Very really nice. enjoyed it. Yeah. Anyway, going on with our actual meals. You went for that, which I just showed you. Up there, didn't I? I showed everybody that. And I went for this here. We're going to tuck into them and then we're going to see what we think of it. So we had a nice meal. We'll go outside and so, tell you exactly what we thought of it. Seems to be a very popular restaurant. Don't it, Carol? Getting really busy. It's getting really, really busy now, yeah. We got here pretty early, but now it's getting pretty busy indeed. So, what did we think of that meal? It was okay. It was okay. It was, was yeah, the price is really, really good. We really, 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 really enjoy that price, don't we? Do. Well, I do. The food was average, I say. Nothing really special, was it? No, nothing special. Just, just regular mundane yeah. breakfast stuff. Yeah, or but no. you. You had dashos, so that's yeah. not mundane. No, it isn't. You can fill yourself up, as I said before, and then just go to the parks afterwards. So, it's good that way, isn't it? Yes, yes. Yeah. And for us, $29. Well, I don't think for, for American prices on International Drive, $29 isn't too bad at all. So anyway, we're going to go to Flea Market now, aren't we? That's what the plan is. Okay, so we're going to Flea Market. See you there. So we're in our car, we could be on our way soon. Right? This car's a Chrysler what? Pacifica. Pacifica. And we're just looking it up and they're around about sort of £60,000, ain't they, I think? Um, I'm not sure I didn't look it up, but you did. Yeah, well, I didn't look it up. My daughter's looking it up now. I think she just said it's about £60,000. But it is brilliant, isn't it? Lovely car. It is really, really good car. It does everything that you want in a car. And also, it's long, it's a seven seater as well. Which is not too bad. And we paid how much for this car? Oh, just under 600. 600. We could have got a normal car, well, a big car for for us, but we needed a seven seater, didn't we, for this journey? We did this and the normal one would have been. Um, I think it worked out to be about 450. 400. Yeah, 450. Yeah. So it wasn't no. too bad, really. Yeah. Yeah. And that was with Andy Discount. Andy Florida Discount Cars. Yeah. And we went through and it's an Alamo. Yeah, an Alamo, and we've had no problem at all with it so far. They've been really good, haven't So they? far, yeah. Mm. Okay, onward to the flea market. So when you go to the flea market on the 192, always put in the flea market opposite Old Town, not like Harold did. Carol didn't do anything. <laughs> <laughs> Stephen put in the wrong one. We're four miles away from where we should be, so now we're going back towards where we just come from. Next stop, flea market on the 192. So we made it here, didn't we? We made it here. We don't do tours. It should we? have been 20 minutes from International Drive to get here. It took gone. us 40 minutes because of somebody putting the wrong 
flea market. There is a number of flea markets in this area. They put in Main Gate. The main Gate, for, yeah, well, opposite Old Town. I put in Old Town at the end because I know if you come to Old Town, you see the big orange. It's just behind that, isn't it? Mm -hmm. yeah, so anyway, we're finally here. It's very warm. I want to get inside as soon as possible. Yeah, we can do. I'm not going to form film all the actual places in here because we did it in our last one. I'll just film if Carol buys anything. Pretty certain that she will. As you can see, this goes on for a long way and there's about six or seven huts like this. They're not bad, are they, these t-shirts? What ones? That one? Oh no, four for ten dollars. Four for ten dollars. Not bad at all. That's so Carol will see these little fans and she's going to buy four of them. She's now pretty quickly going through the whole lot, ain't you Carol? Yeah? I'll, I'll be to look at the colours, what I'm going to get. You're going for the colours. So many colours. So many glittery colours. So what are we getting? We're getting two pairs of beers. Yeah. Oh yeah, one for you, one for me. Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah, brilliant. You can wear your own. <laughs> yeah, um, and what else? And I've got some four fans. And four of these fans as well, yeah. So, don't know how much the years are, but go and pay for it. And then we'll move on. Find something else. So as did you get on, there was... Well, the years, I didn't know what the price was, and he said 2 99 Yeah. Then when he said I had two, two, two lots, he said, oh, uh, two for five dollars. Oh, two for five dollars, so two fifty. If you cash, then obviously they put the Yeah, tax yeah, yeah. You can get a little bit cheaper for cash, can't you? Yeah. Mm. yeah? Not all the time. But it's always worth trying for a discount or something like that year, isn't well, it? Well, didn't ask for a discount. You put it through, it said $15 altogether. Yeah. Then when you put it through, when you see the card, it came up to 16 something. I yeah. Said, Is it 15 if I pay cash? And he said yes, so that's what I've done. Okay then. Lovely. So, we got past one stall. We've got about 500 more to go through. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah. Oh. It's alright. I ain't seen nothing. Tails. <laughs> I've only been here 10 minutes. It's not the idea I don't like shopping, it's the idea that I actually walk further along than my wife. She is right down there. So she's going to walk along here and she's going to see all these sunglasses. We're going to stop for 15 minutes, look at those. And then she's going to come over here and she's going to start looking at this, what she calls scrunchy Evan. She's going to start looking at all this stuff here. And I just looked to get to where I am at the moment, walking around these stalls. That's another half hour I got. Another half hour just to get here. So let's go back and get her and try to move her along as quick as I can. I did want to do some sunbathing by the pool today. I really am not kidding. I've been here 30 minutes. I went back to get my wife and she got to the next stall. I'm literally. It's going to take me an hour, was it? An hour to walk around here. Hours. She actually got to the next stall, and that was the far she got. Scrunchy heaven. Come on. 30 minutes later. So, Scrunchy heaven, you bought three of those, and then what are they coming to? $10. $10, okay. Let's get them and move on, yeah? I will. Oh, goody, goody, goody. I'm so, so excited. We've found some clothes. You're loving it, ain't you? Yeah. Eh? Hey? Right? Yeah. I'm Go to Orlando. I'm in heaven. I'm in yeah. I'm Don't think about Disney World or Universal. Think about clothes. It's always worth coming here if you feel like you want a little snack or something, because they do the food trucks here. And there are so many, and you'll always find something that you will really want or whatever. Two for $16 there. They do nachos, maybe Carol will get some nachos now. Um, I know we did this in one of our blogs pretty recently, so I'm not going to dwell on everything around here, but it is a very nice place to come to. There's so many here, you, you're spoiled for choice, you don't know what you, you want. You don't, do you? yeah, there's like, I've just looked, there's a Mexican place there, there's a grill place over there. There's a pizza place over there. There's so much we've just eaten, so we we're tempted. We're very, very tempted, ain't we? We are. Another grill place there. I just want a drink at the moment, That's but then the so maybe a drink and a little snack or whatever. What's this here? This is Chinese food. 
Yes. Yeah? Yes. So maybe some Chinese. I don't know. Yeah, it's, uh, there's so many to choose from here, isn't there? Hi. There is. There is Anything spot. take your fancy at all? No? I'm just looking around. You're just looking around, around yeah? But no, this is a uh, food truck heaven. <laughs> You're going to get something, are you? What are you going to get? I'm going to try the empanados. 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 Yeah, just to empanado, share, obviously. Whichever. which is, which I don't know what you have Just them ones there. So Carol's going to go up there and get me a drink. Please get me a drink. It's so humid. They do a lot of stuff here. Find out what the price is. So how much did it come to, girl? $10. $10. And how many did you get? Two. Chicken one and a beef one. A chicken and a beef one. And also we've got a, a Coke with it as well, yeah? Yeah. So we've got to wait how long? Five minutes. Five minutes, because everything is freshly cooked for you here, isn't it? Yes. Yeah? Yeah. Or yeah. well, warmed up, I don't know what it is, but it's, you have to wait. You always have to wait for your food here. Yeah. I'm just thinking, opposite here is Old Town, isn't it? And you could always pop from Old Town across the road, come and get a little tank here and then go back or whatever. You could, yeah. Because I think the, the food here is probably a little bit cheaper than Old Town. It gets very busy over at Old Town, so if, if you want something quick, it's best to come over here. Yeah. And just pick something up and then go back again yeah anyway we're waiting for my whatever they called impa what they call them empanada oh i don't go know on. carol will tell what they're called empanada empanada something like that Empanadas. i can't pronounce it i'll get tongue-tied okay bit. so you're waiting for them and then we'll see what they're like so that wasn't a long wait at all was it <laughs> and carol's now doing the unbagging unbagging go on i'm trying to talk and we've, got and, a dip as well. and we've got a dip as well. So, are you going to do the unbagging or not? So, here is our two empty blobbies or whatever they're called. Mm. Yeah, you also get a little dip there. So, we will try these, won't we? we and will. One see thing. what we think of them, One yeah? Chicken, I think that's the beef. And, and that looks like chicken, chicken yeah. Nice. Okay, let's see what they're like. Now, just pull one, one apart. Here's the actual beef, minced beef inside. They're very, very crunchy, ain't they? Yeah, as you break them open, they are. Mm. You get a lot of chicken in there, don't you? Yeah. Look, that's the upper arm. Yeah. But there's a lot of beef as well, wasn't there? And what do you think of them? I'd, I'd have these again. I think mm. nothing, yeah. For like ten dollars, it's come out to be quite a nice little lunch, isn't it? Yeah. Also, you get a lovely, like, little dip here, like a prawn cocktail-y sort of dip, isn't it? Mm. And they're very nice indeed. I'm really enjoying it. Very nice. And very crunchy. They are very crunchy, but not, they're not oily at all, are they? Not what? They're not oily. No, they're not. No, they're like... Like a McDonald's hot pie. That's the texture of the outside of it. Yeah. But not oily. Not and it's not got the um, apple in it, obviously. But no. Very, very nice indeed. Mm. And this is only one of the food courts. You could spend all day here just sampling different food, couldn't you? Good. Mm. So much to choose from. Yeah. So we had to eat them quick because we were shopping with family. And we know they want to get lots of things and get back to the hotel to go to a little swimming tonight today, don't they? Mm. But quick verdict, out of ten I'd give them, I'd say an eight actually. I'd say more than nine. I'd a nine, yeah. Yeah, considering, oh, if you it. consider the price, you could have quite a lot of them, couldn't you, sort of thing. And the idea is really to sort of have one there, have a little drink, have a little wander around, have another little drink. Night time's probably the best time to come here, because I imagine this really lights up. Mm. And it's totally different to what it is daytime. But that was quite a nice little snack, wasn't it? Oh, very, very nice little and snack. And I wasn't even angry. He wasn't, no, he wasn't, no. So... We shall go now, back in, do a little bit of shopping. Oh, she, she's on a mission. Okay there. Yeah, you got something, have you? Okay then, off you go there, girl. Okay there, Carol. You've got a little smile on your face. Oh, it's 599 $5.99, yeah. And then she said to me six fifty. Yeah. Um, with the tax. I said, okay, then I'll pay by card. She said, Oh no, I said, yeah, I'm paying tax, I'm paying my card, so she said, okay then, five nine nine. <laughs> so that was good, wasn't it, eh? Yeah, I don't mind paying the price, but... You, you don't mind paying the price, do you? No, you, me, Carol paying. does not mind paying the price. No, but but she wants a little bit of a deal, don't it. you? There's tax on it, then I want, I'll pay by card, what's yeah. the difference? Yeah, yeah. 
from paying the tax. Well, you knew they was well, pay, paying by cash. They're not going to charge you the tax, didn't you? You knew that, yeah. But um, you don't mind shopping, do you? If you see a price and you're going to buy it, you're going to buy it. Yeah. But when they try to do you, add on little bits more, you don't like it at all, do you? No, they don't. You don't like no, it, no, no. no. You enjoy shopping, though, don't you? I love it. Right. Our son-in-law, Alex, said to me, he actually said, this is his words, he won't go on camera because he doesn't want to actually get in the bad books with Carol, but he actually said is, I know it's the ongoing joke about Carol likes to shop and you don't like paying, but she is a full-on shopper. <laughs> I'm going to catch up with you and have a word with <laughs> Yeah, she said that, but he won't actually say it on camera because he doesn't want to get in the bad books with his mother-in-law. But yes, he actually agreed with me. Carol is, and Carol, you are a full-on shopper. It's a knack. <laughs> and just in case you didn't believe me when I said this is called Food Truck Evan, there is a sign. And it's also got Carol, love you, because she loves to shop. So I'm going to have to talk all through this, because hopefully it's copyright music. Or not hopefully, hopefully it's not. What did you buy? A Cocoa Beach. A Cocoa Beach. Yes. And you got it from this little place here? Yes. Yeah, we don't know what it's going to come up like, do we? We don't. But how much was it? Ten dollars. Ten. Wow, ten dollars. But you get one of these, though. So it beeps. Oh, you get a beeper. Get a game. Oh, I think it's better to take the beeper on. That's got to be worth more than ten dollars. Nice little place. Let's see what the, food, the drinks like. So you got your po uh, poker. You got your coconut drink. Coconut drink. And that is a real coconut, isn't it? Yeah, look. Yeah. And what is it like? What is it like? It's like coconut water. Proper coconut water. Is it just coconut water? That's going to go through you, girl. Can I have a little taste? Mm. Oh, it's nice, though, isn't it? Oh, it's nice. It's nice, yeah. Yeah, we're going to pay the price later on, but that's nice. <laughs> coconut, is, coconut water is a natural laxative, isn't it? It sure is. Yeah. 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 So we're going to pay the price later, but at the moment it's nice. And I see you've got a nice little cherry there. Keep your eyes off of it. You're not getting it. <laughs> okay. And a family bought other little ones over there. You can't see them, so they're okay with that. But it's quite a little, nice little shop, isn't it? And how much was this coconut one, sorry? $10. $10. But it's a novelty, isn't it? It's nice. It's good, yeah, it's very, very good. Yeah. yeah. You know how much I enjoyed the cherries. <laughs> no, no. Now we've got a little bit of coconut there, didn't we? Got a little bit of... Um, pineapple. Pineapple. Yep. And we had a cherry. Yeah. And I turned around and the cherry had gone. I did have it. I know you didn't. Who got it? I gave it to Alex. Son-in-law? Yeah. He likes cherries. <sighs> I sympathise with him. Fine. Shall we go back home now? Yeah. Or back to the hotel, yeah? Her daughter, right? I did almost not have her daughter over, yeah. I did say move. She didn't move. Put your stuff that you bought in there, and let's go. So, we really enjoyed today, didn't we? Well, yeah. this morning, anyway, that first game in the Golden Corral. Really nice, wasn't it? It was. And also then on to the flea market. Yeah, after you getting lost. After me getting lost. Yes, I did get lost. But um, hopefully you got something out of this little vlog, and there will be more coming on. Thank you very much again for watching. Thank you so much if you're subscribed. And if you could just like this video, it gets it out there, doesn't it? Sure. Yeah, if it was okay for you. And until the next one, bye bye. Bye. We're now back to the hotel, yeah? Definitely. Do a little bit of swimming. Yes. Lovely. Bye bye. Bye. We've come right over in the corner of the car park to film this end bit. Bye bye.